last year, my brother passed away. In the following weeks and months, I walked each day in a tunnel of grief. The pain of losing someone so close clouded my vision, and at times I even felt unaware of what was going on around me. I felt so blinded by pain and grief that I simply could not see God. In Luke chapter 24, two disciples, confused and brokenhearted after Jesus' death, didn't realize that they were walking with their resurrected teacher himself. Even as Jesus explained from the scriptures why the promised Savior had to die and rise again. Only when Jesus sat down to eat, they realized who he was. We read in chapter 24 of the book of Luke and verses 30 and 31. And it came to pass, as he sat at meat with them, he took bread and blessed it and brake and gave it to them. And their eyes were opened and they knew him and he vanished out of their sight. Although the followers of Jesus had faced death in all its horror when Jesus died, through his resurrection from the dead, God showed them how to hope again. Like those disciples, we might feel weighed down with confusion or grief. Some of us may have even lost our own loved ones, but we can find hope and comfort in the reality that Jesus is alive and at work in the world and in us. Although we still face heartache and pain, we can welcome Christ to walk with us in our tunnel of grief. This week, let's allow Jesus into our hearts He can bring rays of hope to brighten our fog.